as the sun rises over the African bushveld, the team of Safari Lives awaken to find some interesting signs that have developed over the evening. The wonderful things that you can see out here on a live safari in the middle of the African bush. Of course, for us, life out here means that sometimes elephants come and feed right outside your bedroom window, and the tale of the bedraggled rubber tree is finally complete. <laughs> a very good morning to you, life in the African bush, and this is Safari Live. And on that note, a very good morning to you all. My name is Jamie and I have jean -Dre on camera with me. Brent is heading out with Brian and we have Jerry and Kirsty in final control. We're coming to you live from Juma, Arethusa and Cheetah Plains Game Reserve in the Sabi Sand in the Greater Kruger National Park area of South Africa. Now not only are we live, but we're also interactive, which means that you can send through your questions on hashtag Safari Live on Twitter, or you can email through to questions at wildearth.tv. And as we started the show, the crew of the DRC, which is the main camp, were visited last night by a herd of elephants, including one very tiny little elephant that had a marvellous time last night feeding on the rubber tree. And that is that. It is no longer resting upon the bathroom roof, taking down some of the lats that were leaning up against the wall as it came down. Unfortunately, narrowly avoiding all of the vehicles that were parked quite close by, as you can see. Here we go. Little minor trail of destruction definitely could have been worse. And thus I think it ends the story, because of course we started with this. The tree was originally at that angle on the bathroom roof when an elephant came through and pushed over the gate completely. And it was still alive, it was still looking okay. I think unfortunately it is no longer salvageable. It's been completely deleafed, and the trail of destruction is spread all the way through DRC and out of the gate. And we've got a lion roaring somewhere off in the distance to